guys welcome back to my channel i'm shalene and today i'm back with another shower routine my 2022 shower routine and do a lot of different things in here just starting off by wetting my body and my hair because I, it is wash day routine for me um and yeah i'm just gonna be um using some new products for my hair and if you guys want to see a more in-depth like wash hair routine i can do a separate video on that how i use it and how i properly style my hair and yeah, I'm filming in the bathtub because it's a little bit easier for the water to not get everywhere on the ground compared to in the shower, it's a little harder to film. So just bear with me, the angles and everything is a little bad, but yeah. So I'm getting my shampoo from Garnier for text, and I'm getting my scalp massager and digging that into my scalp and trying to clean my scalp properly. It does have coconut and it helps with dry, damaged hair. So I bought that not too long ago and yeah I've been liking it, it smells good and it moisturizes my hair. So I'm really getting that deep clean clean into my scalp at the back of my head also. I'm just massaging it really good so I can get all the oils and bacteria off and the dirt and I'm just using my shower and just um, rinsing it off as you can see and then I'm getting my Garnier Frutex papaya hair food which is really it smells really really nice you can use it as a conditioner leave-in or a treatment I use it as a hair mask basically I put it in my hair after I shampooed it and then I put my hair up while I do the rest of my body and leave it in for that amount of time I'm taking my exfoliating glove and my triple moisturizing dove. I can never, you can never go wrong with that. I literally always use that as my first base to clean my body, and then I go in with whatever I'm scented shower gels. Yeah, but I always use a neutral or one that cleans your body well, and then at the end you go in with the good smelling shower gel, so it lasts longer. And you still get a good clean before that. So going all over my body as you can see it's a little hard to clean yourself with like a bikini on obviously for this type of videos it's necessary <laughs> um yes i'm just cleaning my back my legs and then i'm taking my shower head it's attached to the bathtub and just rinsing it off it's a little bit easier but at the same time a little harder because i gotta crunch down a lot so that's why it looked like that hunch down i'm taking my razor which is the venus venus sensitive razor it's really really nice to change shower, um the heads the razor heads um and it's yeah it's really nice it shows pretty good and it's soft it doesn't really irritate my skin and i use the same dove tree for moisturizing to shave my body yeah i'm taking the set of fuel exfoliating cleanser i love this cleanser it's not really harsh but you can use it daily um and this one is something i had like little beads or something to help me exfoliate more my skin i'm just taking a rotating spin brush which really really helps to get deep in the pores and wipe away bacteria and dirt and any makeup left residue you know you really gotta get yourself and deep clean everything because things start to build up and if you don't clean every area then it can get really bad so every crevice you gotta clean now i'm getting my foot file and trying to file my feet <laughs> as you can see next up i'm just brushing my hair out with the hair mask because i had like pretty bad knots you know with wavy or like curly hair you can't really brush it out after it's dry and you style it because it'll go like a big fluff ball a big bird's nest <laughs> which i hate so you gotta brush it before take a shower or in the shower or whatever you prefer even though it's not that good to like brush your hair out when it's wet because it's more <clears throat> fragile but that's what i prefer because i got some type of conditional treatment that helps me glide it out easier so yeah i had a lot of knots as well i was doing that face <laughs> it was really bad um, and yeah, I was just brushing my hair out with the hair mask in there and then I'm... 
sorry. <laughs> um, I'm just brushing my hair out. Trying to get all the knots out. This detangler is really helpful, this hairbrush. I bought it like ages ago, but it really does help with wet hair to detangle your hair, especially. Yeah, I'm taking the Fruitex Garnier Fruitex Conditioner, the one that goes with the shampoo, the coconut one. It smells really nice and it's really um, moisturizing and hydrating for the hair, so I did like it. It just glides like butter, it's incredible. Yeah, I'm taking, taking also the Garnier Fruitex leave-in treatment, like styling treatment. I didn't even plan to do this, but it's all the same brand. I literally put it all separately and then I just noticed it's all the same brand. Yeah, I'm just taking my triple moisturizing dove and my brush to always go up underneath my nails because you get bacteria and dirt underneath there so you really got to scrub underneath there. If you don't do that, hop onto that because there's stuff getting underneath your nails. Like it's just not possible to keep them clean if you don't like brush them out. And my toenails are doing that too. Now I'm taking my palm olive relaxing shower gel with my baby washcloth and just cleaning my whole body with that it was really nice and relaxing it's really gentle on the skin sorry with my face as I do <laughs> I just can't help it my, my mouth hurts so bad with freaking braces like oh I'm so over it but yeah I'm just taking that and going all over as you can see a little hard but I'm trying to show you then i'm taking finally my fairy tale um body wash which smells really really good i bought it at bath and body works not so long ago it smells really really good with the same baby washcloth just going all over my body it's really fresh and airy and getting like a fairy tale like fairies for us like Really nice, sweet, um, fresh scents, basically. I do like it. Now I'm just rinsing my body off. And here I have my fairy tale body mist and body lotion, which is really, really moisturizing and nice. It basically has pomegranate nectar, fresh orange blossom, vanilla bean, hyaluronic acid, and shea butter. It's really, really good at moisturizing. It smells really nice. I'm applying it on my body as you can see there. And I'm taking the mist that goes with that. It smells really nice. Also another tip is putting Vaseline and Petroleum Jolly on my wrist and wherever I'm going to spray my perfume on my body mist to have it more long lasting. Here are the products I basically used. The Jergens Shea Butter. The face products I used. And at the end this is the New curl whip um, mousse. I've never tried a mousse on my like waving curly hair, but I really like it. it's lightweight, it's creamy, 